Hi, my name is Nimra, and today I would like to talk to you about how I was able to release a false twin uh, with the help of Patricia and the twin flame body work. So my ascension started eight years ago, and I had started with the most common symptoms that you feel when you're ascending, seeing repeating numbers, especially number 69. And at the time I was um, kind of dating online, you know, swiping on my phone. And for some reason, everything came together perfectly for me to be with this particular person. And I felt that I felt so much love. And for the first time in all, in Honestly, I, I felt like I was with a man that truly respected me. He would take me out, buy me gifts. And like I, felt, I truly felt that he really liked me and was going to maybe be the one. And I, after Valentine's Day, I was about to tell him that I loved him and he broke it off with me. But the day before that, I did feel that I needed to go away, get away from him. For some reason, I had this intuition in me. And when he came home, when he came to my house to break things up, I, I felt that something bad was going to happen. And when he broke it up with me, it was extremely painful. I'm not going to lie. It was extremely painful. A lot of rage came out of me. And for eight years, I did not forget him. I kept thinking that he was my twin because after the breakup, that's when I got guided to watch these videos on YouTube that was talking um, that were talking about twin flames. I was going through all these healing modalities with Reiki, tarot, and I just felt so much pain in my heart. And um, not to go in too much into too much detail, um, I after eight years of working with Patricia, I I came to a point where I was like, okay, it's been eight years now. I still haven't heard anything about him. And every time I would see his pictures, it wouldn't really do anything to me. I wouldn't feel the same that I felt with my when when I felt my etheric twin. Because after the breakup, that's when I started to feel my etheric twin. And I felt all this love coming from this 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 being and um, who would show me these beautiful, uh, beautiful messages wherever I went. And um and I told myself, you need to face reality and really know whether he's your twin or not. And at the beginning of my work with Patricia, she did tell me that he is a soulmate. But I could not take it. I totally brushed her off. And I think because at the time I was so desperate to understand what was happening to me. And I was in so much pain that I needed to hold on to something. And um, finally, after eight years of work, I felt like I was strong enough to face reality. So when I had a psyche body session with her and I asked her the question again, she told me that he is a cosmic soulmate, that he's not my true love. Um, and then she explained to me that these false twins are like give you all give you actually give you back all this love that they probably had taken from you in a past life. And if and she has a good video about false twin that she had done a couple of years ago that kind of explains to you how these false twin energies are created, and it kind of makes sense. So and so my human ego got attached to all this, um, but my soul doesn't really didn't want wasn't going to be with him wasn't wasn't going to let him be with me. So I had so things had to break down. So so the human but the human part of me still got attached for all these years. So after that session, I was still in so much pain because I felt that I was breaking up with him again. Um, lots of insecurities came out, like, oh, I'm sure now he's happy that he broke it off with me. He's probably not even thinking about me. But now after four months, I am at a point where it doesn't really matter to me anymore because now I want to be with my true love. And so I feel like this work that I did with intermittent fasting, application of oils, and my routine and doing my uh, twin flame body work routinely um, helped me clear all these negative emotions. Uh, and and literally, it's like you're the bright blue sky. And that, and that all these negative emotions were these like fleeting clouds that are just stuck there and you just needed to clear them. Um, and that's how you can be um, totally, you can be ready to be um, in physical union with your true love because you don't want to bring all this baggage. I didn't want to bring all this baggage personally. So, 
So if you are at a point in your journey where you are not sure about who is your twin and you think you're thinking about this person and you think that they are your twin, but you are not sure about it and it's been years, have a session with us, email us, talk to us and let us help you.